Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles in Elden Ring. Here we go. We're going to pick on our little favorite victim, um, Mr. Pumpkinhead. See what we can do. did it. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and Elden Ring. We're, we're going crazy here. We're, we're getting all kinds of characters in this game. It's so fun. Anyway, let's get into the build and uh, we'll show you some more gameplay. It's pretty simple. The hardest part of it is getting this mask. So we're going to go over the location of that as well. All right. Okay, I wanted to quickly show you the location of the turtle shell and the mask. The mask is here at Volcano Manor. I'm not going to show inside of there because I don't want to give away any in-game stuff, but once you go to the Volcano Manor um, and talk to the lady, it's, there's a long hallway with a bunch of doors. It's the first door on the right. There's a fake wall there that you have to hit once you hit it with your sword or whatever. Uh, walk through there and it's like a little dungeon. There's items in there. You're going to end up on rooftops. It's kind of crazy, but you have to search around for it. And you will find the mask sitting there in that location. Um, I know that uh, you kind of have to search for it. It's dark and there's enemies in there. But, um, yeah, that's where you find. So you have to get, you know, pretty far into the game to actually get it. I fortunately had a buddy drop it for me. So um, he found it for me. And then uh, the location of the turtle shell. So the shield, it's a shield, and you go to the nomadic merchant, Castle Morn, and there's a little, right here, there's a little, uh, you know, shoot that shoots you up in the air, and you want to land right on top of this tower. So you just face the tower, shoot back up, and come down, and there's two items up there. One of them's a turtle, turtle uh, shield. So that's how I acquired those items, and we'll go to the build here. Thank you. Hello, YouTube. Welcome to the channel. Thanks for all the support recently. I've gotten a lot of views. Um, thanks if you stop by, if you like the video, all that stuff. It's really exciting. I'm having a lot of fun doing these different builds of characters from movies, TV, you know, cartoons Star Wars um, I have a uh, few more builds coming up uh, Wolverine um, from X-Men and then I have uh, Braveheart build William Wallace and I have uh, who's the other one? Oh, Mace Windu from Star Wars um, that's gonna be a little difficult and then I'm also gonna do a tribute to Elden Ring it's gonna be a comprehensive video where I go from you know, start to finish and start being like Super Nintendo days and how video games have evolved. Anyway, so this is my guy. Let's get into the build. Okay, so right now I have the spear. And uh, I like the spear. I think it fits. Um, even though none of the Ninja Turtles had spears. Uh, but it's a partisan, uh, partisan spear. Um, I got the tur turtle shell. I got the Albert Neuronic mask, which I will. I explained how to get earlier. Uh, gauntlets and greaves. So I don't have any armor right now because I didn't think it was appropriate for the look. I have my Radagon sword seal. And basically, for our attributes, we're putting 32 into vigor. Of course, the um, Radagon sword seal gives us extra attributes. So vigor, endurance, and dexterity. Um, so this th this thing doesn't scale very well. The spear uh, D for dexterity and strength, but it's a cool spear. It's got paling thrust. Uh, you can even put a uh, 
Ash of War on it, obviously. So that's pretty cool. And uh, let's show you show you what it does real quick. Ash of War on it, thrust, which is cool. And then, and then of course, you know we're a Ninja Turtle. We're gonna do whoops. We're gonna do uh, a lot of jump attacks, stuff like that. So we have a lot of dexterity, a lot of endurance, that kind of stuff. So my other weapon, and also we can uh, we can take this and we can one hand it and use our shell for protection. Got to use that turtle, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle power. Okay, and then uh, we also have um, our katana. 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 So yeah, we're gonna two hand that baby because we're a Ninja Turtle. We gotta have the shell on our back for protection. And this thing is really good. I got it at plus four. Um, it's uh, the ability on its unsheath. Um, I'll show you what that does. Bam. It's plus four. It's already get, getting good damage. It fix, in, inflicts bleed. Um, so this is, you know, for starting the game... I'm, I'm level 40. Obviously, I leveled up before I made this video, but um, I started with the with the uh, the uh, ninja class or the samurai, and um, yeah, we got the coloring on the. Oh, and I got to show you what I did the face originally. It's pretty funny. <laughs> you guys are gonna love this. Okay, so we take off our mask. <laughs> That's the face I tried to create. Not bad though for you know Ninja Turtle build, but uh, it's pretty goofy. So yeah, we're gonna leave that mask on. So going forward, I think this is a very viable build. Um, we're just gonna keep putting attributes into vigor, endurance, and dexterity, and then we can even do a little bit into arcane because right now we're doing a blood loss build up this thing um, of course you can integrate any type of things you want into it you know just have fun with it uh, the main thing is the look and then you just build from there like I'm looking for like a specific green armor of some sort I know they have it I have it on other characters so um, so yeah this is really viable especially at the beginning like the first two areas Limgrave and uh, the lake area so yeah, I mean, you see how easily we took out old, our old victim, Pumpkinhead. So, anyway, I appreciate everyone stopping by. Like, share, and subscribe. Have a good day. I'll see you next time. Bye.